morning, folks. Well, it's the day after the trip to Cardiff Bay on the Bristol Channel yesterday. Uh, to say the fishing was absolutely bobbins is an understatement. Um, I'm, I'm, I'm under no, no illusions that it, it, one day could be crap and the next day could be good. Uh, it, it's notoriously rubbish, the fishing, at this time of year. I mean, we're mid-February now. You've got the winter fish all going out. You've got the summer fish all coming in. And that's my excuse. And I'm sticking to that. There wasn't a great deal of action. I've put together a short video of, of what I can uh, with the material that I've got. Like I said, there wasn't a great amount of it. Um, and without further ado, I will get on with it. Morning folks, and welcome to the Happy Hooker YouTube channel. We're, uh, we're just about to go through the barrage at, uh, where are we? at Cardiff. We're going out into Cardiff Bay, we're going for a, a good mixed bag day, hopefully. Uh, we've got some marks off Aaron Smith, the Oracle. So, fingers crossed, it'll be a decent day. Right, are you ready, guys? Oh, swap tires, please. Are we ready to rock and roll? I can, it's not. It's not affecting me much, really. and then the barrage is back so it's round that corner. this barrage on it. You thought there'd be other boats waiting to come out, wouldn't you? I'll speak to barrage go through on what I What's it called that marina? Panath? Panath Marina. Panath. One in fucking circles. Barrage control, barrage control. This is Happy Hooker receiving. Good morning, barrage control. Uh, I'm not over sure how it works for getting through the barrage. If you could explain that to me, please. Yeah, that all depends on how much money you've got and what time you want to lock out. Now, we <laughs> lock out on the hour and the half hour um, and inbound on the quarter two and quarter past. Obviously, give us a shout uh, a couple of minutes before and we've allocated a lot to. I think I'm outside the barrage now. Is it the one with the big, with the three big red lights on? Yeah, I'm going out fishing for the day. Yeah, you just come off the water taxi birthday, a little vessel there, you can just see you there. So we'll, we'll allocate you lock number one, uh, which I'm assuming if 
Tash, you up straight outside us, you're straight outside the lock. Uh, we'll give you a green light, to make your way in, tie yourself up, and then we'll lock you down. Absolutely brilliant. Thank you very much, Paul. Yeah. I thought it were. We need to see all the car things. They're all different locks in the street. Three different locks. Three locks. locks. As you said, you just said about being tied up on the pontoon, honey. He? he said we're right outside the first lock, didn't he? So I'm assuming it's that one there. <laughs> Depends how much fucking money you've got. <laughs> See the lock gate, there we go. I don't see a lock gate opening though, do you? They have to fill it up with water. Where do we tie off to? Any ideas, lads? I can't see anybody here at the minute. Danger. We're at a variable head speed. Eh? I don't know. I don't know where to go. I'll go on your side, Tommy. To that, don't we? Yeah. Yeah, too many on one side. <laughs> I'm assuming he's watching us from up there. Yeah. Barrage control, barrage control, Sappy Hooker is now tied off. Hey, watch that, cover base now and we'll lock you down too. 
Brilliant. We saved over an hour. So I think the sandbank's here at the side of the pump up there. So he's just on the other side of it, isn't he? He's about here. He's on that blonde uh, where we started this morning. Yeah, that's where he is. Where we set off this morning, that's where he is. Sandbanks here, on your side. Tighten down. Tighten your clutch. Hey! We've got a fucking fish there, we've got a fucking fish there. Go on, get it up then. Hope he's on that big fucking you know. hook. Uh? <laughs> Hope he's on that big fucking you know. hook. Have you got one on? Yeah. You can't tell with that fucking broom handle you're using. <laughs> <laughs> I fucking bent it round. <laughs> Did it? <laughs> Rob's got the first fish of the day and Rob's got it on. Get out of the way of the camera. Yeah, got faster than that. <laughs> you don't need that. I get to use my net. You don't need that. That's what's done it. Net. You don't need a net. <laughs> Fannies. Coming up. Well, they're getting up there. Stop messing with it. Only 20 foot of water. Where you hold it. Got it? Little soft spot, I would say. Just here. Yeah, got it? Yeah. Both hands. Hold it up for the camera. Turn around. Just have to turn around. I want a picture of it. <laughs> I'm not believe. Let me get my phone and get a picture of it. I don't even know where my phone is. Just on worm. Yeah, just a pure worm. Uh, picture. That's YouTube. I want a picture. Here we go. Stop looking at me. There we go. There we go. Smile. There go. Well, there you go, folks. I'm just showing what you've got there. There we go, folks. 
Grizzly Rob has got the first fish of the day, a foam back ray. Now that's a good sign because we've only just anchored up here. The back she goes. You didn't want to eat that, did you? Are you sure? It's too late now. <laughs> you want one of them in a double figure. That makes a nice dinner. Does it? Yeah. We've cut the wings off. Yeah, what's that So the sandbank's actually that side of us, isn't it? Yeah, we've been struggling this morning. That's the first, in fact, that's the first bite that we've had on the boat. No, never mind the first fish. You'll go then, Tom. Bang, 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 oh, go on. I had a good feeling about this little spot, did I, folks? That's made me smile, hadn't it? I was just in the middle of eating, you were fucking cake. <laughs> That's how you'll not come when you're not taking any home to eat. Did they get any worse? We're sitting back in mule. Like I said, folks, there wasn't a great deal of footage that I could that I could use in a film. I could have put a lot of not catching fish on and a lot of moving marks. We did try probably half a dozen different marks, an hour at a time. 
but the day was just a day and it wasn't to be. Uh, we even stopped and spoke to a couple of the local boats that were out and they were having the same problem. Two of them I spoke to, one of them had, had a conger eel and one of them had, had a rocklin and that was it. We ended up with the ray and, and the nearly cod. Thank you for watching and hopefully the fish is going to get better and possibly the videoing. Ta-da for now!